Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and that's a 68 Mustang Fastback. She's got a numbers matching 289 under the hood and you can see that gold paint is looking sweet. Phenomenal job on the restoration on this car, just absolutely gorgeous. And as you get a good look at the side view, she has got a great stance to her. We got those aluminum Magnum 500s on it. Those are 17s, I believe. Looking sweet. Resto Mod tires. Just a gorgeous car. Door gaps are looking good. Doors lined up nice with the opening. We've got the rocker moldings on there. And check out the interior. My favorite color. Everybody knows I love some black interior in these muscle cars. Looking sweet. Got the fold down back seat back there. And there is a seat under there. Let me lift this up. See, there's a seat and there's seat belts back there too. Carpeting's looking sweet. Headliner looks good. Now the gauges are in the stock location, but those are aftermarket gauges right in the stock location, which is very cool. It is an automatic car. It's got a C4 in it. All the chrome inside there is looking good. All the upholstery is looking sweet. And again, I just love the stance on this thing. Look at the way it sets. That's exactly what a muscle car should look like right there. We got great, great chrome on the back. We got our dual exhaust coming out. You can see the, uh, all the trims around the uh, tail lights there are all looking good. We got our little pony on our uh, gas fills looking good. The Mustang emblem's looking good. Check out the trunk here. Wow, look at that. Looks brand new in there. Absolutely gorgeous. You can see all the paintwork up in here. Everything's looking sweet. You always want to check the lips on the bottom side of the deck lid too. This is nice and clean, nice and smooth. All you got to do is run your finger down it. You can feel it. A lot of times when I'm looking at cars, I'll run my finger in that trunk lid just like that. It tells a lot of story right there. Again, looking down the side of this thing, look at the bodywork on this baby. Nice and straight. No major scratches, dents, bruises. She's just looking absolutely gorgeous. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do consignment. That means we own this Mustang, so you know we checked it out before we laid our money out. Then the first thing that happens to every vehicle here at Vanguard is they go up on the left so we can inspect them, take pictures, and do a video of the bottom side of the car so you know exactly what it's going to look like when it hits your driveway. Now call Tom at 248-974-9513 and don't forget he answers his phone seven days a week and almost 24 hours a day. We're in the Mustang now and it is nasty outside so we're not taking this beauty out in the nasty weather. Uh, we have driven a car. The car drives great. As you can see on the dash here, everything looks fairly stock. Um, it's got aftermarket automator gauges but they're mounted in the stock location. Really, really nice job on that. Uh, it does have a wood steering wheel. That's been added to the car. Um, the, it's got the uh, factory vents here for the AC. It looks like it's got the factory radio in it too, so if you're a radio guy, you probably want to switch it out. They make some radios that look like uh, factory, but they actually have all the latest and greatest stuff in them. I mean, just everything about the car is cool. She sounds amazing. That exhaust sound sounds so great for small block guys. And we can deliver this baby anywhere in the world. You just give us a call at 248 974 9513 and Tom will take care of you. We can help you with financing too.
All right, we're underneath the 68 now, and man, it is pretty under here. You don't see very many of them done to this level. You see a brand new gas tank, brand new uh, exhaust system, brand new shackles on the springs. The spring packs look like the rebuilt units. Uh, you can see it's got disc brakes on it. Uh, it's got those drilled and slotted rotors. The shocks look like they're fairly new. Now the guys will pull these all apart, make sure everything's installed correctly. Uh, we do have a Ford 8-inch rear end. That's what would have came in these cars stock. And she is a 279 gear, if I remember right, uh, and is an open rear end. You see it's got this extra brace to stiffen up the frame and frame extenders to connect the front to the back. Very, very cool. You can see that the parking brake cable's new. We can see that the uh, fuel line's new. We can see that the brake line's new. I mean, just everything under here is looking sweet. We've got an X-pipe set up here, real nice, neat uh, deal there. Both the torque boxes look great. You can see everything's painted up nice. The floorboards are all painted uh, body color here. C4 trans, which would have been similar, what would have come in the car. Big disc brakes up front too, drilled and slotted rotors. We got the uh, aftermarket um, power rack and pinion steering here. We got a big sway bar here. The radius arms are actually aftermarket. The lower control arms are aftermarket. The upper control arms are fully adjusted and aftermarket and coilovers are holding it up. I mean, this thing is all decked out underneath there. I tell you, you might want to get you a set of mirrors so you can put underneath the car and show it off. Now, we went with the uh, aluminum wheels on this one because of the big brakes. That's why we have to do 17s. Now, these are some Continental tires, same tires I got on my uh, everyday driver. We've got uh, two 15 17s up front. Rocker moldings looking sweet, paint looking sweet from down here. You always want to check out this pinch weld on every car you buy. I don't care what kind it is. They all have a pinch weld where the floorboard ties to the rocker. Bottom side of the rocker is looking good. That pinch weld looks good. Now what you're looking for is that pinch weld is two pieces of metal welded together and they'll get moisture between it and it'll start to rust and it'll start to get thicker. You don't want a thick pinch weld. Out back, uh, again, Continental tires and if my eyes worked, there they are. Uh, is that it? There it is. 245 50 17s. And these are some sharp wheels, guys, and they're brand new. Let's get under the hood. All right, under the hood, man, it is amazing under here, also, man. Looking sweet. Uh, we got all these aftermarket braces up here, looking sweet. I mean, going in every direction. Um, you see, it's got Hydro Boost on it, so the power steering pump actually runs the power brakes on this one. So she does have power steering, she does have power brakes. Um, you can see the Edelbrock intake sitting on top, and we do believe all the numbers match up on this motor. Um, we do believe this is the original motor for the car, which is very cool. Um, it's got a real nice little air cleaner on it. The motor's nicely painted. It does have air conditioning. Uh, we got a reservoir here for their um, fluid for the um, power steering. It's got a later model power steering pump you can see down there. Uh, you see that aluminum radiator, I think I already pointed that out. Nice fan shroud here. I mean, everything's nice and neat under here. They did a beautiful job on this thing. Alternator looks like it's a rebuilt unit. Uh, it does have the stock uh, exhaust manifolds on it. I mean, everything about the car is sweet, guys. The bottom side of the hood's all nicely painted. It's got a 600 CFM four barrel carburetor sitting on top of that intake. I mean, this is one sweet machine right here, guys. So she's been on the rotisserie. She's beautiful. She's a fastback Mustang. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Park this stream in your drive.